Hi guys, I welcome you all to the next lecture in our anthropology series. So we had started the topic 9.4. We had uh, seen an outlook of chromo what are chromosomes and chromosomal aberrations in man. We in here we had st uh, we have already studied the uh, the idea that means how the aberrations or genetic mutations in chromosome occur. So whether it is in the number part or in the structural aspect and what are they called and what are the different types of uh, chromosomal mutations that can happen right so today we are going to study some of the important uh, sex chromosomal aberrations okay uh, so in here today i am going to only discuss the clen filter syndrome because uh, i need to give you uh, an outlook of how we are going to go about it so similar a uh, method we are going to use to study other uh, other syndromes also like turner syndrome or super female syndrome or uh, super male syndrome okay so these are other kind of sex chromosomal aberrations that we are going to study but today we are going to only focus on the clen filter and how we are going to study all of them okay so i need you to uh, take a look at the karyotypes again because this is what we are studying numerical changes that means somewhere either it is going to be a monosomy it is either it is going to be a nullisomy trisomy it could be a polyploidy monoploidy now again i am i am not going to do it all in this but i am i am going to tell you that it is di divided in two parts right polyploidy and monoploidy wala or it is either monosomy nullisomy trisomy tetrasomy like that right in this the whole set is gone in this only one uh, in one pair of chromosome either there is an addition or a subtraction now this we have studied this is not the topic for the uh, today if we sit and study this only so fir we will not be able to complete the chapter so please go back watch the video 9.4 ka uh, part 1 and part 2 and then come back to this one uh, now let's start so you have seen the typical karyotype of a human that means we have 23 pairs of chromosomes 22 are autosomal one is sex chromosome and uh, that could be either the sex chromosome could be either xx or xy now what happens in in the time of uh, fertilization as we have studied in mendelian uh, uh, mendel's uh, law of inheritance also if the parents are xx and xy so what happens during the uh, fertilization is that these homologous chromatids will uh, these will become they will separate themselves so they will become like x and x x and y right so this disjunction happens and after this disjunction what will happen they will make a pair right so either it could be uh, xx either it could be xx xx and xy right so this is how the pairs are going to be made right so this is how it normally in mendel's law of inheritance it should happen but when these are numerical or sex Uh, chromosomal aberrations we are studying that means pehle to focus on the word sex chromosomal aberrations what are we studying sex chromosomal aberrations that means in the 23rd number pair theek hai so all these disorders or mutations or syndromes that we are studying they are going to happen in the 23rd pair ठीक है ट्वेंटी थर्ड पेयर में होगा ठीक है एंड इट हैपन्स ड्यू टू द नॉन डिसजंक्शन ठीक है नॉन डिसजंक्शन ऑफ द होमोलोगस सिस्टर क्रोमैटिड्स होमोलोगस सिस्टर क्रोमैटिड्स ड्यूरिंग ऊ जेनेसिस नाउ आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू एवरीथिंग डोंट वरी ठीक है सो वॉट इज दिस नाउ नॉन डिसजंक्शन आई विल टेल यू let's take the same now we have seen the the usual normal case mein okay i'll draw both the cases maybe that is more easier for you to understand then let me this is the normal case and this is 
द केस जहाँ पे क्लेन फिल्टर सिंड्रोम केस ओके ना लेट्स ट्राई एंड ड्रॉइट सो नॉर्मली वॉट शुड हैव हैपन्ड एक्स एक्स एंड एक्स वाई अपने आप को दे विल डिस जॉइन एंड बिकम एक्स 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 वाई ठीक है एंड दे कुड बी इधर एक्स एक्स वी हैव डन दिस एक्स 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 एंड एक्स वाई दीज आर द फोर ऑप्शन दैट विल बी देर राइट राइट ऐसे होना था दिस इज द नॉर्मल केस बट इन क्लेन फिल्टर के केस में वॉट हैपन्स इज आई चेंज द कलर नॉर्मली एक्स एक्स एंड एक्स वाई इज देर ठीक है इन दिस केस द एक्स एक्स ओके इट डज नॉट डिस जॉइन ड्यूरिंग द ऊ जेनेसिस दैट मीन्स ड्यूरिंग द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ द एग और द वेन द फर्टिलाइजेशन ऑफ स्पर्म एंड एग हैपन्स द फर्टिलाइजेशन प्रोसेस ड्यूरिंग द प्रोसेस ऑफ एग यू नो फर्टिलाइजेशन दिस डजन हैपन सो वन पेयर गेट्स दीज आर फोर डिफरेंट नाउ दे हैव सेपरेटेड राइट सो वट हैपन्स हियर बोथ द एक्स गोज इन टू वन एंड द अदर प्लेस इज नथिंग सो दे इज अ जीरो ठीक है दे इज अ जीरो एंड दिस नॉर्मली हैपन्स एक्स एंड वाई ठीक है एक्स एंड वाई हो गया ठीक है सो वॉट हैपन्स नॉन डिसजंक्शन हुआ दैट मीन्स दे डिड नॉट डिस जॉइंग दे वेंट इन टू वन पेयर ओनली एंड द अदर पेयर वॉज जीरो दैट मीन्स नथिंग लेफ्ट इन दैट पेयर सो वॉट विल हैपन ठीक है इफ दिस बिकम्स लाइक दिस विल बिकम एक्स 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 ओके दिस विल बिकम एन एक्स एक्स वाई ओके लेट मी चेंज द कलर टू बी वेरी क्लियर दिस विल बिकम एक्स एंड जीरो एंड दिस विल बिकम ओके वेट दिस लाइन लिटिल बिट आई कैन मेक इट बेटर या this uh, yeah this will be y and 0 theek hai this is y and 0 so we have got four cases theek hai this case where it is called xxy is klen filters syndrome okay this is klen filter syndrome xxx is super female now what is super female we'll do to tomorrow but i'm just showing you the case this becomes super female x0 becomes turner syndrome and y0 becomes death nothing so this is y0 nothing so this becomes death so in the case of klen filter syndrome during the u genesis the xx should have been uh, separated but that non disjunction of the homologous sister chromatids ठीक है डज नॉट हैपन एंड विद द वाई इट बिकम्स द क्लेन फिल्टर सिंड्रोम सो यू अंडरस्टैंड लेट मी कीप दिस दिस वे ओनली नाउ लेट्स गो सो क्लेन फिल्टर सिंड्रोम इज एक्स एक्स वाई दैट मीन्स इट इज अ जेनेटिक डिसऑर्डर विच इज मो विच इज एक्चुअली दिस इज अ मेल्स दिस ओनली हैपन्स इन मेल्स बिकॉज दे हैव एन एक्स्ट्रा एक्स कॉपी ऑफ एक्स ठीक है सो जनरली अ मेल वुड बी एक्स वाई अ फीमेल वुड बी एक्स एक्स बट हेयर द द मेल इज एक्स एक्स वाई ओके सो ही हैज अ वन एक्स्ट्रा कॉपी ऑफ एक्स ठीक है एंड दिस हैपन्स बिकॉज ऑफ द नॉन डिसजंक्शन और फेलियर ऑफ द मोलगस सिस्टर क्रोमैटिड्स टू सेपरेट ड्यूरिंग द सेल डिविजन प्रोसेस ठीक है एंड दिस अकर्स वन इन थाउजेंड मेल्स दैट मीन्स इट इज नॉट वेरी रेयर ठीक है वन इन थाउजेंड इज नॉट दैट रेयर ओके एंड इसमें क्या होता है मेल बेबी इज बॉर्न विद मोर देन वन एक्स्ट्रा एक्स दैट मीन्स ये एक्स एक्स वाई भी हो सकता है इट कुड बी एक्स 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 वाई भी हो सकता है इट कुड बी इवन एक्स 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 वाई एंड मोर देन दैट ऑल्सो इट कैन बी बट मोस्टली इट इज एक्स एक्स वाई ठीक है सो यू अंडरस्टैंड वन पॉइंट द सेकेंड थिंग इज दैट मोस्टली uh these kind of syndromes maybe uh, uh, be it uh, klen filter syndrome turner syndrome any other 
happens in the case when the pregnancy or the woman who is carrying the baby is ab above the age of 35. Because with the increasing age, the the uh, females, uh, these uh, ovum and o ovaries, okay, they start to also not work that properly. So there are more chances of having a baby with, with these kind of syndromes. So this line, ki, uh, women with pregnancies after the age of 35 have slightly more chances of having a baby with the syndrome will go for everything, Klenfilter, Turner, um, any other okay, that we are studying, okay, Down syndrome, anything that we are studying. Okay, so basically abhi, what, what we have discussed already, we have discussed that Klen filter, normal karyotype kya hota hai? Normal karyotype is, normal karyotype is 44 plus XY ya XX. That means 44 autosomal uh, chromosomes and either xy or xx which will mean 46 total right but abhi hum, we are restricting our uh, discussion to only male so uh, because in only males Klenfilter syndrome is there so 44 plus xy is the normal karyotype for a male okay for a male it's the normal karyotype but in Klenfilter what will happen Klenfilter ke case mein it is 44 plus x x y that means he is having a one extra copy so it makes 47 that means there is a trisomy in the 23rd pair okay in the sex chromosome there is a trisomy okay now you see whenever these mutations will occur some symptoms or some kind of a effect it is going to have on the phenotype also. So this is Klenfilter syndrome where there is a one extra copy of X you can see this is the extra copy of X you can draw the karyotype also like that. Now let's see what are the symptoms that that can have you know it can have on the person. So mostly the the body of the males becomes slightly uh, like a female. For example, they have gynecomastia. Gyne gynecomastia is uh, uh, growing, you can say, uh, breast becomes like little, there is a breast development, okay. So generally males don't have breast development, but in gynecomastia, there is breast development, okay. Then little bit, you can say mildly impaired IQ also is there. That means it has a bearing on your IQ also, okay. Then the stature becomes tall. So the person having clen filter is a little tall. Okay. So they have wider hips. So hips are wide. Okay. They have long arms and legs. That means they have long arms and legs. Okay. And they have like narrow shoulders. Okay. Tendency to grow fewer chest hairs. And on, on all the body, there are fewer hair. Okay. They have the problem of. Uh, you can say weak muscles, they have weak muscles and osteoporosis, okay? Osteoporosis is there, weak muscles. Then they have tendency to lose their chest hair, we have talked about that. And female type of pubic hair, okay? And small testicular size, okay? So these are certain symptoms that come with the Klenfilter syndrome. So you can remember a little bit of them, for example, gynecomastia, osteoporosis, okay? Tall heighted, mildly impaired IQ, take a wider hips, long arms, long uh, and legs. Okay, then female type of pubic hair and uh, breast development. Okay, okay. So now symptoms may we have talked about uh, the symptoms. I have showed you the picture also, but uh, let me tell you that uh, this picture was a cartoon picture because it's not ethically right to take any person's picture with the disease right so we uh, we have tried to take just a cartoonish picture so that it does not uh, you know impact somebody's life like that right so you can also use certain pictures cartoon pictures like that now treatment kya hoega iske liye? treatment is based on the signs and severity you can say what is the what are the symptoms that the person has and what of how severe the 
symptoms are okay so treatments what the treatments includes there are fertility treatments because generally the person becomes little infertile okay with these kind of issues they become infertile okay so there is psychological counseling also because this causes mental depression all of that then removal of excess breast tissues okay then hormonal replacement therapies okay so male affected uh, by a uh, klenfelter syndrome are given testosterone which is a male sex hormone because to boost a little uh, normal development because you, we have seen breast development is there the pubic hair are like females right the uh, testicular development is not there right so what is this this is hampering the person's own male uh, characters right unke male characters are not getting developed so testosterone is that hormone in the body of the males that that develops the beard theek hai the voice gets deepened theek hai there is a uh, you know increase in the testicular development so all of this is uh, you know controlled a lot by the testosterone in the body theek hai so that is why they are given testosterone if the treatment begins near the age of puberty it can serve boys to have proper body development so it is not like uh, you won't say that is it is a very fatal disease now we'll see others many others in the chromosomal mutation where there are fatal also so this is not that fatal okay so you can lead a uh, you can lead a normal life if you have these kind of therapies so you can lead a normal life okay then there is edu educational support and speech therapy because some people with this clen filter syndrome do not speak very clearly their articulation is not proper so then you can give them educational support and speech therapy also who the people who have the problem of language theek okay? hai and these things are certain things that you need to do for the rest of the life a person who's uh, suffering with clen filter syndrome he would need certain kind of a uh, you know uh proper medical care theek hai na but even then they can lead a good life theek hai so this disease can be and and diagnosis ke liye you can just write diag diagnosis ke liye there is amino syntosis amino syntosis or chronic willy sampling chronic willy sampling now you don't need to go so much deep into what is a chron uh, chronic willy sampling or amino syntosis amino syntosis uh, they just inject certain fluids and try to you know see whether the baby is having certain problems like that right so you don't need to dig very deep into these aspects because then you'll uh, eventually forget because we are going to study a lot of these diseases okay so i hope uh, the idea is clear tomorrow also we are going to do it the same way we are going to develop a normal karyotype and a uh, other person the for example if we are studying turner then we'll see x0 right so this is the way that we are going to go about it we are going to see the normal karyotype then the person with the disease and certain uh, uh, certain symptoms treatment diagnosis all of that right so uh, guys if you did like it please like share and subscribe thank you so much